Hello, and welcome to Skyrim. As yet another, yet another character. I think the novelty of having a hundred sneak wore off. So I'm going to do the mage stuff, like I said I would at some point. Here we are in the middle of part of Forbidden Legend, which isn't really a mage thing, but one part of the amulet you get from this is, well, from the mage things, so I'm also going to eat on stream and be extremely impolite. I can do that because it's my stream. Haha, -ha, I don't know. Hooray, the stream is working properly. What I need to do, as always, is get restoration to 40 and get that respite perk. The rocks are interrupting my kill cam. trying to hit me through the wall. Oh you, you're silly. Draugr War Axe? Wouldn't that be labeled Nordic, usually? Uh, oh well. Where's this lightning trick? Yeah, he's probably in here. Oh no, it's a switch. Got it. I already forgot the order. Of knock. <laughs> Hurrah. I have solved the ancient puzzle. Or something.
Is that all of them? I right, lit up the room when they're all dead. And now, one of these things. Whoops. I didn't mean to press the key hole. All the Galderson fights have a gimmick, uh, or they would have if this guy wasn't already dead. I think the extent of this fight's gimmick is he has a lot of minions. The one that's part of the Mage's Guild quest line, Mage's College rather, the gimmick there is that you can't harm it for like 10 seconds while Tolftier needs to figure it out. So it's not too exciting. And the other one's gimmick is that it has fake copies of itself. Now for the third piece, because the second piece I already have, and I've shown it on stream before. Why is it still directing me here? I've clearly got this part of the legend down. Oh 
Dang right. Blah blah notes blah. Clearly read his notes. Ah, uh, yes. Now it will show us the way. Garman's Hall. Sorry, I think I had forgotten to adjust the game volume. Whoops. Oh, wait. You probably have something to deliver to me. I've been looking for you. There's a new museum open. Looks like that's it. Have to go. <clears throat> right then. better time of day than than uh, 2 a.m. to pillage tombs. Oh yeah, I have the Courage spell, and I actually s figured out what that does off-cast, but if a dead dragon shows up, I'm probably definitely going to shoot it, because it's worth doing. Given that I intend to do the Mage Guild quests, or I mean college quests, after I finish this amulet nonsense, there's probably a good chance we'll be seeing a dragon attack Winterhold, because that pretty much always happens. So... Nothing to worry about. Leave me alone, zombies. I'm trying to read here. Hawk, dolphin, dolphin snake. Um, the last place I left off, like, on camera in the mage quest line, so where this character is ready to start it, was, um, Returning the stolen books. The next step is to consult Tolfdir. And then... Uh, I think the Augur of Dunlane is after that. And then looking for the staff of Magnus. Stuff like that. I do like the Mage's Guild. I mean, college. I keep saying Guild, God. I don't like Guild anymore. <laughs> yeah. 
And yeah, I was pretty amused when I found out what Courage did. My question is, why does Courage do that? I mean, I think every spell used to do what it does to dragon corpses. But... Why now? Or why Courage? Uh, the Dragonborn D DLC? No, I didn't complete that. It's just that the 100 sneak archery character guy... Girl, rather, that I was using... I got tired of the gimmick, I guess. The novelty of 100 sneak wore off. So, now I'm a mage. Again. Where is this one guy? Oh, he's up there. Conjuration has probably always been my favorite thing in this game. I can't use this because there's a dude. But this character is focusing on conjuration as well as alteration and restoration. No destruction though. I'm a melee mage. That oh yeah, that's right. Uh wait. Ah, uh, there it is. Um, I guess you could call this a hidden temple. And yes, I am playing as a high elf. I like the Fusro Da shout that he makes, and also having that much extra magicka at the start is pretty nice. I've never really run low on it. Actually, I think I need to upgrade stamina more. I need to get 40 restoration. How much do I have? 38. That'll be the next level, most likely. Ow. I could power level restoration. Yay. But that's only for silly people. Yeah, I could have been a Breton, but I don't know, I wanted some variety and free magic, I guess. No, he still got to use his gimmick. Also, my volume mixer's in the way of the chat, because I'm dumb like that. Oh, there we go. So this guy's gimmick is going to be like, yo, I'm three guys, and the secret is that you just target the one that's not at full health. So, um... Yeah. He's not... <laughs> yeah. I don't know what to say other than a lot of, uh, yeah. And, yep. Mm-hmm. Yep. That's all I got. By the way, this is my character's face. High elves always look kind of smug. Oh, 
Oh, you can tell the clones apart also from horns? Okay. Well, also, if you strike the fake ones, they instantly die. That's another way to do it. Ooh. I'm not using armor. In fact, I'm using the alteration thing that's specifically not for when you aren't using armor. I'll have to disenchant that, I guess. I have to make a pit stop at White Run or something. That troll is all like, raise the roof! But I think the roof is perfectly fine where it is. Am I gonna get attacked by vampires? I think I already got attacked by cultists the one time you do that. No vampires. There's a dog in my room. Should have traveled to Dragon's Reach in the first place. I need to go here to disenchant everything. I need to go get a Zura star on this character too. Hello Darcy. You're not stuck behind my bed, are you? No, you can still move, okay. <laughs> Come to Dragon's Reach to discuss the ongoing hostilities, like the rest of the great warrior. Or maybe maybe Darcy is stuck, hang <laughs> on. It seems this damnable conflict has claimed everyone's passions of late. Me, I prefer my books and my spells. There's a tranquility in magic, don't you think? It is simply energy to be harnessed by those with the will and knowledge to do so. There we go. Darcy was stuck behind the headboard of the bed because it's close to the wall, and Darcy is fat. <laughs> At least in comparison to Lily. Anyway. Silly corgis. I can walk to the shops, I think. I can at least manage that. Just in case I had any diseases I'd forgotten about. It's kind of funny how easily that can slip your mind. Heard they're reforming the dawn card. <laughs> Take a good look around. I'm sure you'll find everything's. Take a look.
Yeah, high elves are actually the fastest race in Skyrim because they are slightly taller. It's kind of funny. I realized I didn't need to talk to Farangar about something. I want to see what he has for sale. That was an alternate reality, by the way. Dragons breathing fire in the sky. Have you heard? There's been another dragon attack. Come to Dragon's Reach to discuss the ongoing spells and incantations for those with the talent to get. Aha. Uh -huh. That's what I was hoping for. More or less. You know, if you've got. I'm in the college at Winter Hold. You can go shove your aptitude up your butt. Thank you. The aptitude? You should join the Mage's College in Winter Hold. My colors don't match anymore. Father says I'm too young to change the sword. The live crack is Why not? Well done. Not many enchanters could pull that off. Weren't you just having lunch? Why were you ducking for a second? <laughs> I'm the commander of the guard here in White Run. My boys will keep you safe, don't you? I sound important, but I'm not. I mean, I could do that Mark Hearth quest line with a person who can just conjure a sword and kill everyone in the prison that much easier. Talos the this! That's what Talos does, right? Yells a lot. I don't want to do the Markar thing again right now, but I still have to go there. Because it's the closest to my goal. I'm allergic to stupid cities. Some say it was built by the dwarves. I don't believe a word of it. <sighs> All right, let's go.
need to watch where I'm driving my horse. I have no idea if the adoptable children actually do anything because I would never want to adopt children in the video game. Or in reality, most likely. What are you? Oh. So much for that contract. I might need to go do something regarding the Dark Brotherhood on this character eventually. Yeah, I never got the impression that Dark Brotherhood stuff was ever anything personal. It is just business. I can respect that somebody wants me dead. It would be nice to know who it is, just as a little, you know, piece of information. But... Good thing the claw that I need for this dungeon is right here. Good thing this note that tells me not to be here is no longer there. Ha ha ha. So, the Galder amulet that we're in the middle of reforging, right? It's, uh. Bear Dolphin thing. Yeah. The Skaldar amulet is kind of actually really not that interesting. The individual pieces increase uh, health, stamina, and magicka by 30, respectively. The full amulet, spoilers, increases all three of them by 30 in one amulet. What do I even have as an amulet right now? 40% frost resistance. That might be more helpful than 30 of each attribute. I don't actually know. Uh, these doors didn't quite make it all the way. Oh, this is an ivory claw one, isn't it? Sneaky. The ivory claw is the thing you get in the previous dungeon that I was in. Yep, you need two different claws. One of them is from one of the previous dungeons you need to do in this quest line anyway. Now to refight all the gimmicky mounds. Oh wait, no, I have to place the amulets first. And then... Yeah. These guys are gonna be like... We're going to gimmick you to death, except I'll probably kill them before they manage to do any of that.
that was one. Things are bursting out of coffins when I'm not even, you know, unpaused. I would like to know about all those mods that are like, you can kill children now, is if children were not supposed to be killed, what happens when they do die? They wouldn't have any unique... Wouldn't they be missing part of, like, programming? Wouldn't, like, children not have ragdoll physics or something, for example? Just curious about the technical aspect of it. Part three. This guy's gimmick originally was that he couldn't be hit immediately, so I guess that translates to him teleporting over here. Uh, children do have complete animations. So there are mods that let you play as children also. They're probably missing some voice stuff, I would at least assume. And then that happens. Hey there, Golder. I re-killed all of your dumb sons, or whatever is happening. Do 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 do. And that's the end of this thing. Look at how boring it is. It's worth a lot more. It might be more useful overall than 40 frost resist. I can't say for sure. Also, Galder has, like, a bunch of pocket change. Okay, thanks, bye. You can also see it on my person. Uh, wait, hang on a second. What, what's going on here? This thrall got caught in the door. Uh, I can't pull it free. It is truly stuck. How did that happen? Are you a punching bag? Ah, uh, I can't really hit you and propel you around. We zombie swing. Courage, you say. Apparently, he resisted it <laughs> while being dead. Dance, puppet, dance. And yes, let's have enough to talk about killing children. Though those children in Fallout 3 that I'm pretty sure you're referring to are also really annoying. They're like an entire 
underground town of children that are like, we're the worst characters in the game. <sighs> I might broadcast Fallout 3 or New Vegas once I stop feeling like this, I guess. Should probably Yeah guys, stop talking about killing children, focus on the stream. Like this stream right here. Isn't it beautiful? Thank you, environment, for allowing me to make a terrible joke. Now then, winter hold. Killing children and horse physics have nothing to do with each other. I don't understand. I mean, I guess people were debating horses and realistic application of horse things last time. I, I don't know. Let's go speak to an old guy about old things. Look, it's the eye of totally not an evil artifact. Hey, what's up? It's always in pity now. Does he have information about our wonderful discovery? Is that the one about something buried beneath Sarfon? Something that men and men have fought over? I'll have to make a point of rereading it. I don't recall the details. I just can't seem to tear myself away. Whatever this is, its beauty is like nothing I've ever seen before. If you'd allow me to indulge myself for a moment, I thought I might make a few observations. I'm sure you've already noticed the markings, quite unlike anything we've seen before. Iliad, Glamour, Daedric, and even Farmer. None of them are a match. Quite curious. Now, I'm not sure that you're quite as attuned as I am, given my extensive years of experience. This marvelous object, it practically radiates magic. Mm, I don't seem to regenerate magicka faster when next to it. Okay, the orb is might not necessarily be evil, but it's going to be established momentarily that it is too powerful to be in the hands of men or mer. Man or mer. Let's go. Really? Well, I'd like to know why. More important. So we're going to go have a little chat with you and find out exactly. And Ancano acts absolutely not differently to you at all if you are a high elf. In fact, most things in the game don't. Though you can do the Thalmor Embassy bit a little bit differently, I think. I think you can successfully disguise yourself if you're an Altmer. I'll get to that sometime. It's been so long since I finished that part of the main story quest that I don't even remember what's after it. Probably where Parthenax shows up. I mean you no harm. Okay. It is good to meet you in person. I'd simply like to talk. I've given us a chance to. The situation here at your college is of dark importance. I believe it is due to the very the energy coming from it. TLDR, the Eye of Magnus is too powerful and needs to be dealt with. And so I have come here personally to tell you it must
must be dealt with. You said this. You must understand. My presence here will be... I'm all too aware that... Nevertheless, my order will not... As you may have learned, the world is not... Indeed, many in the order believe it has already. Rather, something will happen. Unfortunately, I fear his perception may be more coherent than ours. I... I am sorry. Now, I'm afraid I must... It is within you to succeed. Never forget that. I'm sorry. What, you what is the meaning of this? I'm sorry, I'm afraid I don't understand. Don't play court. You asked to see a specific member of the college. Here he is. Now what is it that you want? There's been a misunderstanding. Clearly I should not be here. I should simply take my leave. What? What trickery is this? Yeah, You're yeah. not going anywhere until I find out what you're up to. I am not up to you. So I guess normally you're supposed to ask Tolfdir where the Augur of Dunlane is. If you ask the Archmage about it, he's like, is Tolfdir telling stories again? Tell him to stop doing that. But I already know where it is. So I'm just gonna go there. Arbitrary trapdoor. I don't know if there's anything else interesting down here. Wait, Bretons live in Daggerfall? I thought they lived in High Rock. I mean, I thought Dagger... Uh, wait. I was gonna say I thought Daggerfall was the... the, um... Red Guard, but they're from... Hammerfell. It's not really that important, overall. <laughs> All you need to know is that there's actually a place called Elsewhere, spelled really silly. Yeah. And it's where the Khajiit come from. And I didn't realize how dumb that was for a long time. Ah, Daggerfall's part of High Rock, okay. Mystery solved. I have clearly gone the wrong way. I don't know what the hell this is. It's got the Oblivion symbol on it. And I can hear skeletons creaking. What the... actually know what this that I have stumbled upon is. This is probably why you're supposed to talk to Tolftir so that you can get directions. Instead of just wandering around. Where's the fun in that? That's the auger. Still, you persist. Very well. You may enter. He's really easy to persuade. <laughs> For being a big ball of gas. I am that which you have been seeking. I speak slowly, and my dialogue cannot be skipped past. It is already begun. 
those who have sent you have not told you what they seek, what you seek. Indeed, and so you have come looking, though you do not know why. Like others before you, you blindly follow a path to your own destruction. That's on Kano. Your path now follows his, though you will arrive too late. I will arrive directly on time. Could you please speak faster? You and those aiding you wish to know more about the Eye of Magnus. You wish to avoid the disaster of which you are not yet aware. To see through Magnus's eye without being blinded, you require his staff. Mm -hmm. And that's in Labyrinthian, except I have to go somewhere else to learn that. What is this creepy subtitle telling me? I'm not- he's not speaking anymore. Stop it, game. Ah, this is... the roundabout way... with the, uh... mysterious hand. I need to go this way. I have no idea what that hand is. I'm sure it's important. I probably need a certain set of specific rings to place on the fingers which will cause something to occur. If I had to assume. What's this way? This is probably the way I suppose. What the heck is this? There's a lot of weird stuff in the midden. This is. This could be connected, or it could not be connected. You lack the required item. I wonder if perhaps this would open an ob oblivion gate. Were I to possess the correct thing to activate it? Answer yes. Most likely. Or maybe it's an Atronach Forge. Yeah.
There's really no point in summoning an astronaut, I don't think. At least not now. Eh. Ice Wraith. No. I need to get out of here somewhere. Here we go. I think this is the exit. <sighs> Gotta go talk to the Archmage. He's gonna be like, go to this place. And I'm gonna be like, okay. <sighs> I forget what the place I'm sent to right now is called. What you learn here will last you a lifetime. Really? And what might. I'm sorry, what? Well. I'd certainly love it. And how do you know of this? Did you really? And he specifically mentioned the staff of Nagy. I... I'm <laughs> with your initiative. Of course, someone will need to follow up on this. <laughs> A most impressive attitude. Keep this up, and you'll do quite well for yourself. Something as specific and ancient as the staff of Magnus. I'm not sure we'd ever find something like that. I seem to recall Mirabelle mentioning the staff somewhat recently. Why don't you see if she can tell you anything? I'm quite pleased with your progress, you know. You've certainly proven yourself to be more than a mere apprentice. Well done. This circlet once proved invaluable to me. I hope it can be of use to you now. There's something you can do useful with the forge that's not worth the hassle? Well, it sounds like something you can go ahead and just flat out tell me what you're talking about for once. Hooray! This circlet is an improvement over the hood. My hair is a lighter color than I remember it being. Hey, what do you know? It's a dragon. I totally called it. Ah, it's a blood dragon. Oops, that's the wrong button. My good sir, would you kindly mind... Oh, thank you. I was just about to ask if you could land. Don't I restore Magicka faster near this thing or something? Oh, you need at least 90 Conjuration? Guess what I'm going to get eventually anyway. I think my conjuration is at like 73 or so. Conjuration is like the best school of magic. Usually if a dragon attacks the college it goes down quickly, mostly because all of the mages gang up on it. Cool. Cinematic finish here. I would love it if the summoned sword disappeared during that animation. That would be quite funny. Did my illustration hit 40 yet? No, it's 39. Sigh. I'll wait to spend that one perk point.
I think all spells used to do this, but for some reason, courage is the answer now. Can I get this guy off the lawn, at least? It's gonna be difficult. Just need to get off the lawn, okay. I will fit you through this window. I have to wonder what a dual casted one could do if I had that illusion perk. I guess I can't squeeze him through one of these windows. Oh yeah, I got it. I got it over the wall. No, he's on top of the wall though. So I was close. Does hitting his tail still count? Yay! So long, gay Bowser. That's not really... That doesn't really have anything to do with it, but... Uh, what was I actually doing now? Oh yes, I need to go talk to Mirabelle. She's probably not outside to fight dragons with me because it's 6 in the morning. In game terms. I have to go upstairs. Hey. Please don't bother the Archmage. Well, now that's an odd question. Why in the world? I see. I only brought it to his attention. They were apparently under the impression we were keeping mages based out of syrup. My understanding is that all they... I was quite surprised to find them on Odos. It became clear they're trying to hoard powerful artifacts. Looking to con... No one here. The Synod seemed convinced it was some... It sounded like they were heading there, though they were... I suppose if you're intent on looking for the star, there's a chance they might be in the Zolt. Hey! Just don't expect- Arniel, you just stole Mirabelle's bed. You jerk. Now where is she going to sleep? What happens if I cast Courage on a person? Have you managed to find the the staff of Magnus? It's not- it doesn't make him courageous enough to get out of bed. Courage seems like it would be a limited application spell because what it actually does is makes people not run away. Have you managed to track down the suit or the staff of Magnus? Could you at this point theoretically skip Nzolf entirely and just go to Labyrinthian? Because I think that's where the staff is. Not that I'll do that or anything. <laughs> Personal space invader. I chuckled. Okay. This way. I'm sure we will encounter random distractions along the way. 
This is Skyrim, of course. Like this Stormcloak soldier who we're ignoring. First, what's this? Because we're right next to it. Is this where is this where uh, Solokinir revived? It might be. I think it is. Oh, you need a key to go into Labyrinthian. Okay. Fair enough. Oh no, wolves. Like four of them. What am I going to do? Um, there's some guys on fire over here. That's more interesting. Dare I ask? Okay, so the mountain, the saber cat, the saber cat died. I guess it also killed this conjurer. Is there anything else around here? I must investigate. I hope it hasn't triggered the battle music never stops playing bug because that is like the most irritating thing. Why not? Like, I don't even know what your deal is. I'm just looking around, okay? Also, I'm a better contra than you. Look at these things that I conjured that killed you. Why even bother with the rest of the conjuration tree when you can just use bound sword? Huh. You're mostly using destruction magic and restoration. That's not conjuring. Though I'm not really one to talk, I guess. Fire Archonok to explode. Yep. I love it when mages say, I'll see you burn, and then use ice spells on you. Huh. How about that? It just says void salts? I guess this is a recipe to make void salts. Okay. Doesn't specify what kind of soul gem if it needs to be filled. These conjurers are cheating. They're using flame atronox that aren't that don't count as a summoned creature. If they did count as a summoned creature, my sword would instantly dispel them. But they're not actually using spells to summon them, there are just atronox placed there. this whoa 
Staff of Ice Storm. Now that's interesting. Does it overwrite my- yeah, it does. If I ever need a ranged attack, I've got overkill. So... Why aren't you breaking physics like you should? I tend to expect wheelbarrows to break physics in this game. There's a variety of gardening implements. Where'd it go? <laughs> Where did the wheelbarrow go? Here we see ruined books in their native environment. Where did it go? Seriously. Okay then. Ah, I've cleared the cave, apparently. Let's have a nap. For no reason. I didn't... I thought this cave wasn't quite empty yet. Why am I suddenly finding a bunch of forged recipes? Okay, actually, yeah, it does make sense to find these forge recipes with a bunch of conjurers. Anyway, what was I doing? <laughs> Going this way. Let's just go on foot. That way we can meet interesting things and attack them quicker and not lose a horse. Why would I buy a horse if I don't want to use it? Because I think it'll die? Good question. I've got no answer. Horses are best used for traveling very short distances, obviously.
Let's not debate horse physics again. There's nothing to debate. <laughs> Come on, guys. That thing was a Charis. It's basically a bug type thing. They're annoying. They have tough exoskeletons and they poison you. They're often found with Falmer. That's about it. Darcy, what you doing? There's a dog staring at me. You help me level up my healing. Thank you. Oh, it was already at 40. I want to know where the lock is on those gates. Apparently I had no trouble finding it. That's what the spears come out of.
Yeah, when you summon bound weapons, you are borrowing weapons from the plane of Oblivion, similar to how you borrow Daedra and Atronos. At least that was the idea. That Conjuration still has the Oblivion mark as its symbol. I don't know who you're borrowing these weapons from. But they charge a reasonable fee of nothing. Good to know that Dweemer Ruins are wheelchair accessible. I guess these things don't push out? I don't really want to take much of the stuff that drops here because it weighs a lot. I'm pretty sure you can read the Daedric runes whenever they show up. Also, they were either used in an unaltered or upside down state in Homestuck. It's funny you should mention that I should take a Centurion Core because I'm already carrying one in case of I don't know. But I, I remember that they have a point somewhere. There's probably going to be a Centurion. The spell didn't go. Ah! 
He doesn't sound like he's burping to me. I don't know what kind of burps you're hearing, but the shout of this high elf doesn't really sound like one. Probably a centurion soon. This character has really low lockpicking skill, I just noticed. It's sort of changing the lock position until I can find it. Oh, what do you know? It was without moving at all that time. that on my bar? Never use it. Check out these stone beds. Yeehaw.
Yeah, your lock picking goes up when you fail to pick the lock and it breaks, but... It is nice having a lot of lock picks instead of having like three and needing to pick something. I might not be obsessive about losing lockpicks, but I am obsessive about quick saving. Ah, that's where it was. That's an important thing. Flames will become important soon. As will Frost bite, but I don't have that, but there's a tome of it. Oh man, a master door. I don't really want to mess with that. It's going to take too long. I just need to find the place where I'm supposed to go. I don't have a key. I'm, I thought this was supposed to be opened by an NPC, though. Wait. Wasn't that the key that was on the guy at the start of the area? I thought I looted him. Did I seriously forget? Well, what's this? Uh, no, I think it's probably in here since I haven't been here yet. <laughs> Dwarven Sphere Master? Oh my god, what? I don't even know what happened.
This is the locked door, right? Yeah. What? You can't resist Ice Storm, that's not fair. What's that? A mage should wear plate mail? I disagree. Allow me to tell you why. Protection spells like Stone Flesh are 2.5 times as strong if not wearing armor. And that's why. Well, I totally shouted, you heard the entire thing and it didn't work. Why is shouting so buggy? And now I can't spell cast either. You barely even care. First of all, the dragon skin spell doesn't give you armor rating. It's like 80% reduction or something. And secondly, 2.5 is only level 2 out of 3 of the thing. Thirdly, most mage robes are heavily enchanted without you having to do it yourself. I don't know why I'm gonna take this lever. I think it actually goes up past times three, but I'm not sure. Besides, investing in alteration also allows you to increase your magic resistance as a passive ability. And if dragon skin is 80% resistance, there's also armor factored in when you use the thing. See, I have 150 without having any actual armor equipped. So... I could still reach the limit, I think. Besides, I'm sure it's not that big of a deal. Gamros, is that you? I'd almost given up hope. Let me get the door. Done with Gavros. It was the Falmer, wasn't it? If Gavros is gone, there is no. And you, if you're here for treasure, wisdom. It didn't work the first time. Well, I was right, wasn't I? Folk Gavros had to cart it all the way back to Syridin. Left the rest of us here to fend off the damnable Falmer. You found. How in the world? That's it. That's it. 
I don't know who you are, but you have just saved this. In fact, who are you anyway? You are. Savos wouldn't even grant us an audience when we came to you. But now I don't much like this, I'll tell you. Come on, I'll explain on the way. No matter what Gavro said, this was my idea first. The council is going to know that when I get back. I was the one who thought of using this, this oculory. I don't know what the dwarves called it. Something unpronounceable, I'm sure. From all our research, it seems they were intent on discerning the nature of the divine. This machinery, all of it, was designed to collect starlight. And then, I'm not sure, split it somehow? It was my idea to replace one of the key elements with our focusing crystal. Months of enchantments went into it. Let's just hope they got it right this time. Hurry up, slow poke. Here it is. Magnificent, isn't it? Took an incredible amount of work to get it running again. Now I'm hoping it'll all be worth it. Place the crystal in the central apparatus, and we can start the process for focusing it. Results. They're not at all what they should be. This projection should be lit up like the night sky. Something is creating an incredible amount of interference. Something in Winterhold, it looks like. What are you playing at? Is this some attempt to stall my work? So what is it? Did you know what we were attempting? Are you here to make sure your plan worked? Well, explain yourself. You show up here just as our work nears completion, and now I can't get any results from this because of something at your college. Do you think me a fool? Do you think I'm too stupid to make the connection? You've ruined my work! How did you do it? Either you're lying to me, or you have something at your college, don't you? Something immensely powerful, beyond anything I've anticipated. What is it? Eye of Magnus. Well, I suppose that that means what I think it does. Well, that's interesting. Yes, the staff. Interesting. I can't explain the details. That would be giving away many secrets the Synod have learned over the years. Also, I doubt you'd be able to come 
comprehend the details. Have you seen the orrery in the Imperial City? It was the inspiration for this idea. Instead of projecting the sky, we project all of Tamriel, and then harness the latent energies to overlay the positions of... What's important is that all of this work was designed to reveal to us sources of great magical power. Purely to help safeguard the Empire, of course. And yet, in the end, only two locations have been revealed to us. One is your college. The other, well, that can only be labyrinthian. So, mage from Winterhold, Despite your intentions, I've beaten your little game. Even if all you've said here is lies, I know you have something in Winterhold the Synod Council will be very interested in. So fine, trudge off to Labyrinthian in search of your staff. I shall return to Cyrodiil and deliver my full report to the Council. This is not over, I assure you. I think I've discovered more here than I could have hoped to. Your trickery won't confuse me. I think we're done here. So is there a shortcut out of this place, or am I going to have to go through the entire dungeon again? Because I seem to remember I had to go through the entire dungeon again. Ark, why do you want me to kill this guy? Come on. He's probably gonna get killed somehow on his own without my interference. Is there anything over here? No. I am not using any mods, actually. Whoa, whoa. You have done well thus far, but try I guess this is the shortcut, probably. It is imperative that you return to your college at once. I somehow missed this guy entirely. You will be called on to take swift action. Before. Rise to the challenge and discover what you are capable of. You are on the right path, and you will prevail. Thanks for the tip. Ah, uh, here we go. Have I beaten the game yet? No. Though I did beat Dawnguard's questline on stream as a different character. This character I plan to finish the mage one with and then probably keep doing the main one. I've never actually completed the main storyline before because, as you might know, Skyrim is really, really good at distracting you from doing anything important. And instead just doing all the other things. I should probably install some mods like UI improvements and improvements to the map and stuff like that, but I don't really intend to use oops many if I can help it. And, um, with that, we just need to report to Savos. And then after that, I think I will have to stop for now to get something to eat, so that I remain nourished. Oh no, what is this cliffhanger? I don't do much with the offensive magics.
I still have these equipped. The Archmage is dead. I can still move his body? Okay. I'm not allowed to search him, but I can physics him. Are you alright? What happened to you? Uh, I told her. I can hardly believe it, but there's no time. Whatever happened here has affected Winterhold as well. I'll do what I can here. Go now, go. Uh, dignity is hard <laughs> with physics engines. Oh crap, I accidentally killed a chicken. Or at least hit one. Now I have a bounty of five gold. I've had these things kill NPCs before. I think I've also had a dragon attack during this. Or at least somebody I know has. Don't remember if I had it happen too. Things are kind of irritating, but not that dangerous, I guess. I don't think those guys from the college are actually helping me. I don't see anyone else down here. Thank you. 
Or maybe they're fighting them over here, yeah. All right, I need to loot those things, I guess. I'll get to that. Well, it wish I could say, Tolkdir and I can try and keep this contained. You need to get your hands on the staff of Magnus, now. What? Are you, are you sure? This, that can't be a coincidence. The Archmage, he... He told me it was from Labyrinthian, and that I would know what to do with it when the time came. I think... I think he meant this for you, then. I'm not sure why, but there was something very personal about it for him. I think you should take this amulet. It belonged to Savos, but I think it would do you when you take it and get out of here. Bring back that staff before Ancano brings the whole college down with His amulet is just like plus 50 magic or something. Yeah. Boring. Where's Tolfir? What happens if I do this? I can't. Okay. Oh, you can walk. Oh, good. Dog. Savos' corpse has already been moved. anyone in here? I'd like to find Tolftir and see if I can get an alteration spell. Or a few. You consider restoration a valid school of magic? Good. Not that I require... It can make life difficult when one's colleagues fail to... Spells and incantations for those with a talent. Hmm. I don't really need a better healing spell right now. What are you doing? I don't think Tolf Deer is in here anywhere.
What? How? I'm a wanted man because I accidentally hit a chicken. Good enough. I'll just confiscate any stolen goods you're carrying. And you're free to go. All right then. Um. He did a bad job of confiscating my stolen shoes. Oh well. I didn't even kill a chicken, I just hit one by accident. If I killed it, it would have been 40 gold. Or at least 45 or something. Have to, since I can't count on my brother for any... Wasn't quite... Options were not supply. Without the coin to pack up and leave, I decided to take... Very funny. I'm sure you've no... So I'll sell... I've been burned a few times. Made a few bad deals. Yeah, it was... I shouldn't have believed the story and just refused to pay. Some line about this clothing and Ingol Barrow. Something about place. What was I thinking? Even if it. I don't even care anymore. You want to check it out? Fine. Fine. Here. You get killed on account. But I suppose if it does actually turn out to be worth something, let me know, will you? Oh, a bit of this and a bit of that. I need to go explore that eventually. Story is so useless. I... Heard they were filming a dawn guard, vampire hunt. I think that's probably enough for tonight, because I need to go eat something. I'm just going to stop by Solitude and do some boring item management selling kind of things. If I do anything off camera with this character, it won't be Labyrinthian. Maybe I should save that barrow that I just learned about also for later. But yeah. This has been me, Shag. Thanks for watching. Glad it was entertaining to those of you who thought it was entertaining. And I will probably stream more tomorrow. And that's it.